What is up guys, it's Soulbash. We are back with Taichi Panda Heroes and we have a new character to look at. It's actually the very first five star character that I've gotten, Striker. Now Striker is a magic dealing character. Let's see, let's get into here. I'm actually gonna go in through his card because it's a lot easier to look at and it's, everything's here. His magic roll features stacks buffs to deal heavy crits. Uh, faction, dark killer, magic equipment of course. Backstory, a mysterious ranger, striker's skill with a bow as deadly as his poisons. So this guy does damage over time with poisons that stack on things, and he can also do some other things that are pretty cool. Uh, let's take a look at his skills. The first one is Pestilent Arrow. Deals damage to enemies and debuffs them with a stack of plague. Lasts for 8 seconds. Each hit will add 1 stack. There's a max of 10 stacks. So that deals damage and then debuffs them. And it lasts eight seconds, stacks 10 times. That's pretty nice. It's a powerful skill as well. The second one is Demon's Departure. Increases movement speed and randomly debuffs a target with the plague, which will explode and turn all nearby enemies into zombies. Lasts 1.5 seconds for heroes and six seconds for monsters. That is pretty cool. It does increase the movement speed, and if there's somebody around, it transforms him into a zombie for one and a half seconds and if it's a monster for six seconds that's a pretty good crowd control spell and uh one of them oops uh, let's get out of here kind of things the third one arrow barge deals damage to targets enemies debuffed with plague will take extra damage the more plague they have the more damage they will take so this ability you're going to want to use more or less after all of these and once all 10 stacks of those because if you max them out i'm sure you're going to get the maximum amount of damage from arrow barrage and his rare skill deals damage to nearby targets increases crit rate by 20 percent at the max level it's 85 percent and crit damage by five percent max level being 70 percent for the main hero now someone did tell me something in the last one we did with one of these uh, actually gonna have to swap him out after I go show you what his skills do and then use a different hero to show you his rare skill because you can only use a uh, hero's rare skill if it is in the sidekick slots so actually we're gonna tear him up first uh, actually have enough shards to take him up to a blue hero so that is pretty awesome a lot of cool stats and alright we have everything equipped good to go um, all right we can level that skill up again and we'll take a look at it last but let's get in here and check out his abilities and see exactly what they do all right we are on path two of Satan Thor's Falls and let's see if we can't find some stuff to use these skills on and test them out uh, the first one is the one that does damage and then adds the plague and you can tell it does quite a bit of damage and it did hit multiple targets so that's pretty cool you can see there it does a lot of damage it continues through so it's pretty nice it actually goes all the way through two or, uh, or more enemies and the second one I'm gonna show you let's get a couple of them around and let's use that ability okay and it didn't turn those guys into anything hmm it's kind of weird that was the ability that you were supposed to turn them into zombies for uh, six seconds. Um, let's try it again. Try it with some different ones. These guys here. And no, they did not transform, but I did get the speed boost. So that's interesting right there. Um, we'll make note of that and see if it is a problem with the skill. Now the third one is the one that you want to use after you get all the plagues stacked up and it is that right there it does a lot of damage about a 20 second cooldown so it's not too bad it'll give you time to get the stacks back on from using your first ability and i have to say striker does a lot of damage uh this is probably the most damage in character that i have currently now uh and it's gonna be really interesting i want to get him into some pvp and uh play with it a little bit um, now we're gonna go switch out and we'll play with the rare skill and see exactly what kind of damage it does all right we're back we swapped out to the panda and I have him in the first sidekick slot we'll switch over to the skills and let's gather some things up 
And what this is going to do is it's going to deal damage to everything around me and increase crit rate and crit damage. So let's see how much damage it actually does. About 18,000 at this level. It's not too bad. Area of effect. And it's going to increase the damage that I do. So that's not a bad skill on a hero. Uh, let's test it out again. It's about in what 75 second cooldown so that's not too terribly bad you can use it actually a couple times throughout some of these uh levels that are in the game because some of them take quite a while to actually get through uh as soon as the cooldown is done we'll test it out again and gather up some more all right timer's just about up we've got some uh phoenixes right here swirled up and bam that does a lot of damage it got a cool graphic to it all right, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions about this hero, leave them in the comment section below. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.